coaching staff, huh? Yeah, we wanted to get back to our good old habits and and uh, getting more shots at obviously at the at the goalie's feet, and that's exactly what we did. Helped us get uh, you know get the early lead, and uh, I thought we played good. How does this transformation happen? Where you know last week uh, was uh, really difficult to even get some decent ozone time, and then uh, tonight first period, 17-7 shots, and the guys were all over it. <laughs> Well, it's not like it's a switch that we're, you know, okay, tonight we're not going to shoot, today we, have, today we will. I mean, you know, there's, there's a team that defends in front of you, and yes, maybe the mentality was more, uh, was, was to be a little more dangerous offensively, and I'm not going to hide it. We did get some pretty good rest uh, this past week, but our practices were based on uh, scoring goals mm -hmm. on creating chances mm -hmm. and uh, I think it paid off today I couldn't help but notice but you had guys in in front of the net so they were able to kind of maybe reach towards uh, towards rebound so that you know obviously yeah, that, that's always you know what you want to score goals you want to be number one you need good net front presence for that first shot and then you need uh, to be hungry on uh, on rebound and I thought we did this uh, today what about Vile at the other end I mean he was like a circus act there tonight I mean he was just flying uh, who's that Vile the goalie the, uh, back oh, the other our, end. our goalie yeah he got the St. Yeah. Louis helmet on uh, <laughs> Uh, what 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 do you have to say about his performance? I mean, you got the shutout, but I mean, what? Uh... Oh, it was good again. You know, he's been uh, both of our goalies have been right. have been good, and uh, people would be tempted to ask, you know, after a shutout, who's going to play next? But I did mention it uh, to Dan this morning uh, in in my interview. Our plan was to split uh, the two games with in between the two, uh, no, the two of them. The the goalies were told yesterday and. Uh, I'm going to go forward and uh, do exactly as I uh, as I mentioned that uh, as I mentioned it to, uh, to the to our goalies. Right. So, so do you think that when when they're playing well together, they kind of push each other? You know? Probably a little bit. Probably. And there's nothing wrong in having two two good goalies. So uh, you know, both of them are playing well, and our job as a coaching staff is to try to keep them both. Uh, being hot that's that's what we're trying to do what's the challenge now you got you got the same team again you know saturday night what's the what's the challenge to get the w there well we did get some like you said some good ozone time we need to build on that we had a certain strategy uh, coming out of our zone uh, that, that i thought worked pretty good are they going to counter with something else uh in two days maybe so we'll, we'll obviously try to be ready for that but overall is uh play a similar type of game okay